rack installation is an easy process, but here are a few tips to make it even easier. When sliding a rack segment into a T-slot of an extrusion, make sure it is properly aligned. If you experience excessive friction during sliding, use a rack installation tool as shown. Once the rack is placed in the desired location, use a 4mm Allen key to tighten the set screw on the rack clip. If the set screw is over tightened, you would not be able to install another rack segment. In that case, simply loosen the set screw until you are able to mesh the two segments properly. Once the two rack segments are meshed, use the rack installation tool to ensure they are properly spaced. Tighten the set screw on the lip of the second rack segment to secure it in place. If your design makes use of multiple rack segments, repeat this procedure for all segments. Once all rack segments are installed, slide the pinion housing onto the extrusion. Please note that the design in this video makes use of roller wheels, but other linear motion options are also available. Slide or drop the T-nut into the extrusion as shown, and use a 5mm Allen key and one M8 16mm screw to secure the end stop. To secure the opposite side of the rack, you would require a rack support T-nut, a regular T-nut, and two M8 16mm screws. Simply install the T-nuts as shown and tighten the screws, securing the rack with the end stop. 